Today on the Daily Dose, SNH Green Stamps. Founded in 1896 by Thomas Sperry and Shelley Byron Hutchinson, SNH Green Stamps became the leading customer loyalty program in the United States, which reached its zenith during the consumer driven 1960s when the company issued more stamps per year than the U.S. Postal Service. Purchased by merchants such as department stores, gas stations, and grocery stores, retailers handed out green stamps to customers at a rate determined by the merchant, based on a customer's total dollar purchase. Issued in denominations of 1, 10, and 50 points, shoppers licked and stamped them onto 24-page collector books issued for free by SNH, each page holding a total of 50 points, while a completed collector book contained 1,200 green stamp points. Once a shopper had amassed enough green stamps, they could either shop the free SNH Idea book, as many as 35 million books distributed each year during the 1960s, or visit a local green stamp store to shop for dishware home appliances, toys and sporting goods, jewelry, and more. A 1963 magazine article wrote that the average retailer paid $2.45, some $23 in today's currency, for enough stamps to fill a collector book, while many shoppers consciously chose one retailer over another based on how many stamps a merchant gave out for each dollar spent. Over the years, as SNH green stamps reached their market high, competitive loyalty programs tried to penetrate the SNH monopoly, including greenback stamps, gold bond stamps, and blue chip stamps. Yet none could compete with green stamps' entrenched dominance in the U.S. market. By 1972, however, SNH green stamps began its precipitous decline, thanks in part to a U.S. Supreme Court ruling proclaiming that SNH Green Stamps Company violated the unfairness doctrine of the Federal Trade Commission by restricting the trade of green stamps to a select group of retailers, leading to a steady decline in business until the company's 1981 sale to Baldwin United, followed by its 1999 purchase by Lucadia National, which was a holding company established by a member of the Sperry family. After the explosive rise of internet e-commerce, Lucadia National announced that SNH green stamps no longer held value and could no longer be redeemed, while the company's corporate shell was purchased in 2013 by Bubba Gump's shrimp company founder Anthony Zalesi, who plans to relaunch the company using a new business model making SNH green stamps a bygone memory for senior Americans everywhere. And there you have it, SNH green stamps, today on The Daily Dose. Get your nerd on with The Daily Dose. And if you enjoyed today's episode, share the link with a friend or colleague so that they too can learn something new every day.